I'm backstage with the cast of the Fablements, Golden Globe winners, the Fablements, yes. How are y'all feeling? What a moment. Does it mean something extra special because you're telling Steven's story? It does. Oh, hey, right on cue. We were just All talking right. about you. Yes. So is this the rose ceremony? It is. <laughs> are you a Bachelor fan? Yeah, <laughs> Who would you give it to? What? Who would you give it to? Christy. Oh! oh. Why, why is that? Why that choice? She produces all my movies and she's, she keeps my head above water. Oh, what a beautiful Aww. blessing. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Spielberg, does this win mean something extra special to you given that it was your story that you were bringing to the screen? That's, well, that's why it, 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 it means so much to me because you know, the fact that I told a story that uh, based on a lot of memories that Tony helped to organize into an actual three act drama with comedy and the fact that Tony found a way to take all those disparate memories and put them into uh, a narrative that was able to say something about not only my family and what it was like growing up inside that wonderful wacky family but also because so many people have recognized themselves in Sammy, in Bert, in Mitzi, in you know in, in certainly in uh, Benny and in and Boris and all the characters. And I think the greatest takeaway for me is that people do see their families in the fable maze. So it's not just a it's not just a kind of vanity mirror I held up when we told the story. Yeah. So we all had to try to kill the related. <laughs> How'd that go? Well, seems like it went pretty well. We have our own family, you know that, don't you? Yes. <laughs> We're not really related. Right? <laughs> this guy over here is sort of like he, we had to. He, he forced us. <laughs> so when we meet again, you know, we'll know that we were in one family. It always feels like never be able to get, get, We'll never be able to deny the fact that he played one family. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so many of the actors Mr. Spielberg have shared in conversations that they couldn't believe that they were selected by you. And Michelle shared with us that she couldn't believe that you asked her to play your mother. I couldn't believe she said yes to it. Oh, now I'm so I believe. happy. Now you believe? <laughs> I thought, and I know Seth has said when you got the call, you thought you were in trouble for something you, you said. I assume anytime someone I respect calls me, it's because of a joke I made. And that I, uh, but no, it was it was a good call, so thank God. <laughs> yeah, it was, I'm so happy. But we go way back. We, we do. Did, we, we did Freaks and Geeks, our company, you know, uh, DreamWorks did Freaks and Geeks. Uh, the first thing I ever did was because of Steven, so yeah. And now what does it mean to you to be here in this moment? with him again. It's insane. It's truly special. <laughs> and uh, and it's not lost, I don't think, on anyone here what like a uh, an honor and rare gift in a in a career of gifts that this this is, you know? Yeah. Well you're such a gift through all your work. All of you, the movie was one of my favorite of the season. Truly. I saw a lot of myself in it. So thank you very much and thank you for taking the time to talk to us at extra. You know, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.